Well, thank God that ordeal is finally done and over with. <sighs> Don't worry your pretty little head about that, sweetheart. Speaking of head... How did I not notice this before, hmm? Go into the kitchen and get the first aid kit from the top drawer. I'm gonna go get all this blood off of me. Sweetheart, did you hit your head on the pavement too hard when I was dragging you back here? No, that's what I thought. Now, enough back talk. Go. Oh good, you didn't get a concussion and can follow simple instructions. <laughs> I'm so proud of you. Now then, hop up onto the counter. Hop up onto the counter, now. Good, don't move. This'll sting, though I can't imagine you're a stranger to pain when you're around me. Good. You did so well, sweetheart. I'm so proud of you. Now then, tell me, did you do as I said? You stayed away from her, but she still came on to you. Are you sure? All right. I believe you, but I still need to make sure you don't forget who you belong to. Of course, sweetheart. Not only will this serve as a reminder for you, this will ensure that any other vulture circling around you will sink their claws into someone else. You're mine, sweetheart, and I'll make sure you remember that. I left some clothes for you in the bathroom. Do what you have to do and get changed. Once you're done, come find me. Got it? <laughs> oh, sweetheart. You didn't think you'd be leaving after what transpired earlier tonight? It was a hassle to convince your parents that you weren't kidnapped and you were actually staying with me for the evening because you weren't feeling well, so I highly suggest you do as I say. That event drained all of my energy and patience and you and I both know how I am when I have no patience left. Now, go. Oh good, that was fast. Now, go lie down. I said, go lie down. Sweetheart, I already told you, there's absolutely no way I'm letting you out of my sight after what happened earlier tonight. So, your only options are to get into bed yourself, or I'll drag you in. There we go. That wasn't so bad, now was it? <sighs> Finally, back where you belong. <laughs> Why so embarrassed, sweetheart? We've done this multiple times before. In fact, we've done far more embarrassing things than this before. <laughs> How cute. Tell me, sweetheart, how long are you going to play up this innocent act, hmm? Need I remind you what we did just a couple of nights ago? Hmm? Or that time in the janitor's closet? You can continue to keep up the innocent act if you so wish, but we both know what you really are. <laughs> I love it when you get flustered, sweetheart. It makes it all the more fun to tease you, and all the more fun to do more sinful things to you. <laughs> Is my little pet flustered? Is that why you're trying to hide from me? <laughs> you can try, pet. But no matter how much you try to hide, no matter how hard you try to hide, I will always find you, but you want me to, don't you? 
You want me to find you and make you into my little pet, right? Is that why you can barely say anything? Why you can barely look me in the eye? <laughs> no, I do enjoy this reserved, demure side of you. There's another side of you that I enjoy more. Shall I show you which side that is? Hmm?